Welcome back to Trails of Cold Steel 4, uh, video number 154 so far, and uh, dang, I'm I'm still at chapter 2 or something. When do I get to Act 3? Maybe after the events of the Pantagruel, we'll find out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay, so for today's video, like I said from last video at the end, uh, Vantage Masters... I'd love to. Oh, yeah, I'd love to kick your ass. <laughs> no, just joking. Um, what do I got last time? I don't remember that I fight. I, I got a pretty bad memory. I'm sorry, you guys. That's the reason why... I oh, wait, no, it's not Shadow. My bad. Dang, I don't know. Yeah. Oh, well, uh, I'm, I'm going to try the Witch because Witch is my favorite. Let's begin. Of course, gonna play normal and then heart. A beast. Here's to a good, clean match. Dang! Look at the strength. This guy's a beast. I think I did fight someone that has the beast. Oh dear. Uh. Uh. Yeah, sure. I'll try it with this. But the good news, I go first. Ooh. Uh, I'll think about it, but next turn, maybe. So for now, I'm going to move you right here. Ow! Yeah, best not to do that, because this guy, counterattack deal plus two damage. Jeez. Uh, I'm trying to think about this. Yeah, I'll do this one for now, and then, uh... And, uh, yeah. I put him- I put her in the front, so hopefully he doesn't attack my... Oh yeah, crap, I forgot what's his skill again, or the other one. Oh, wild draw. Oh wow, cost one mana, nice. Ooh, okay. Alright, so I'm gonna, of course... Wait, hold on. Uh, Ooh, yep. I'm gonna do this. Are you in the front. Because what's nice, I can attack right away. And yeah, I don't get counterattack. You attack this one. So yeah, I'm gonna give the... Wait, is it this? Yep, heaven, so yeah. Attack right now is at six. You need to back off just in case. I'll summon you next turn. Alright, come on, Lloyd. Uh oh. Probably gonna kill my. Uh... What? Okay. So if I move back. Then I lose it, right? Ah, oh, crap. Cause, uh... Let me check. Let me test it out. Yup, it does. But, you know, he's in the front. I need to put her in the front. Uh, why not? I'm gonna... Wait, hold on. I'm gonna attack you. Why not? I'm gonna give more, uh... Yep. Uh, I am not gonna attack because ouchies. She has to stay in the front, so I'm gonna use skill. Kill you. There you go. So it's a good idea to have ranged um, units against this beast. I mean, yeah. Damn. Hits like a truck. Uh-oh. Oh, is that a golem? Oh, crap. What is... Lloyd, what are you doing? Aren't you gonna attack? You haven't even attacked yet. Okay. Ooh. Look, I have so much... Okay, whatever. For each enemy card's defeat. But unfortunately, I need to take... Yeah, this guy out first. Or... Well, yeah, I need to take him out. 
Wait. Oh, I forgot. Um. Ah, crap. Well, I'll take the hit. Yep. I uh, might heal next turn, hopefully, but... And don't forget to attack. What is he doing? Dang, he has a lot of earth. That's good to know. So bring out a bunch of, uh, of your heaven. Okay, I can summon you. Oh, wow. If I can kill it, I can get more, uh, get gain attack. There you go, seven. I can, uh, he I gotta heal yourself. Oh, dang it. There's, like, so much, uh, stuff going on. Five, five. I mean, that beast has so much health. Ow, dead. You know what? A scale just in case you. But he's gonna die anyways, but I don't know what's Lloyd doing. Oh, I hate that bird. The one in the right that Oh Well he does have other element yeah, it can attack twice. Ooh. Yep, you're sealed. Okay, fire. Take her out. Well, I'm gonna wail on, on him, so... I'll summon you later, hold on. I'm gonna move you right here. And it's nice he cannot counterattack, so everyone attack. Dang, Lloyd. It's a pretty long battle, but... Because that beast has so much health. Oh, I win. Dang, you're good at this. Oh yeah. What do I get? The coal? Hmm. All right, that's Lloyd on normal, so I'm gonna challenge him again, of course, Cause which I do on everyone. Let's take a look. I'm I'm still gonna play as the witch because. Uh, oh, it's this one, the golem. Oh wow. This one. Uh, uh You know what? I'll try it. I'm gonna try instead of uh well dang. He doesn't have a lot of water, so next time this one. Huh. I might need another win maybe, but because he has a lot of, uh, yeah, I'm sorry, like these guys, so I'm gonna take out one of this. I mean, I like this one, but it costs six, and they have to be in the front. I don't know what Lloyd is doing. Oh, whoops, wrong button. All right, I might gonna do a fast forward so I can speed this up until something happens. So, uh, here's to a good clean match. Yep. So I'm gonna fast forward this. Oh, nice. I'll show this off what I get. Ooh. Well, I'm gonna change you. There you go. I'm fine with this. Alright, so I'm gonna fast forward.
good at this. Oh, wow. All right. That's Lloyd for you <laughs> on hard. I got some pretty good draws there. Damn. All right, GG Lloyd. I cannot wait to uh, play Vantage Masters against... Uh, uh, what's her name? Um, oh, dang. I, I can't believe I forgot her name. The main protagonist of Trails of the Sky, Estelle. Yeah, Estelle. Oh, I got time with this with this one right now. Oh, finally, Ash gets to talk to, you know, the one of the survivors of Hamel. Yep, Joshua. But dang, unfortunately, the other one died. Man, that sucks. Let's chat with him right now. Hey, Kurt and Ash. Good to see you again. Happy to have your instructor back. Very much so. It was only possible thanks to everyone's help. Aggie was pretty impressive with that sword of his. Really see where he got the name Heavy Blade. Yep. Those two weren't bad either. I got a couple of swings, but I was just one of many taking part of Operation Bust Rain Out. What? It was for me and Kia. Maybe our timing was lucky, but credit goes to everyone equally. Joshua, Ash. Uh-oh. Don't the two of you have something important to talk about? Yep, like the one in Hamel. Yeah, this is sad though, but... She's right, don't put it off. I mean, this is a one time, you know, to talk, you know, to each other. Uh, everything's going to shit right now. There's no guarantee you'll be able to see each other again. Yeah, true. I mean, that's what uh, Muse said in General Le Guin. Le Guin. Yes, you should sort things out now. There's no de denying that Raquel has become home to you, Ash. But I'm sure there's value value in learning about the place that led... Oh, the music just stops. Oh, here we go. This is going to be sad. Hamel was just... Oh, this music again. Oh, man. Oh, this is definitely a purple thumbnail. Like every time when you when you're in Hamel or when they talk about Hamel, this music starts. Man, I love it. So Hamel was just a small village. It had no more than a few dozen inhabitants. As a result, there were very few children living there. Huh. Louis was the oldest at 16. My sister, Karen, was 15 and I was 6. But there was another boy too. He was three years old. Man. He was too young to play with us. No wonder why. But ever since he was a baby, we looked after him. No wonder why. Because he didn't have the time to, you know, know more. You know, Joshua. Man, I was looking forward to playing with him when he was a little older. Yeah, that would be Ash, man. He was the youngest... He was almost like a little brother to me. Damn. But then those peaceful days abrupt, abruptly ended. Man, those bastards, man. A group of Yeager dropouts pos posing as the royal art. Wow, open fire on the villagers. What the hell? I watched on as Jan and Amelia were shot. There were blood everywhere. Their son fell to the ground blood all over his clothes we fled we ran and ran too afraid to look back survival was the only thing on our minds oh this is messed up that boy didn't die though he had merely fainted from shock oh there they are oh my god Joshua uh, whoops uh, we had no idea eventually we made it out of the village Damn. We stayed behind to distract our pursuers. He told me and Karen to keep running. Damn, there he is. That's Joshua right there as a little... Oh, oh Lowy right there. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, but we got ambushed by another group of Jaeger dropouts. Oh, my God. Oh, this sucks. That's truly heartbreaking. So that's why there's only three survivors. 
Well, it would have been four if they didn't get ambushed, but she didn't make it. Damn it. She sacrificed herself, probably. I, I don't know, to distract them, and I don't know. I, I've heard it before, but it gets me every time. That's what happened 14 years ago. At least, that's how I remember it. That boy we left... Oh, that boy we left behind might have a different perspective on the events of that day. Damn. But, you know, he didn't know. He didn't know Joshua. He may have hated us for escaping without him. And I can't blame him. The bullet you fired at the Emperor you did, should have been for me. Damn. Oh my god, Joshua. It's alright, Ren. It was a shock when I heard about what happened in Heimdall. I realized the burden that boy from Hamel had to live with. Yeah, so it's Ash because he had the curse. He suffered so much. I mean, well, Rain was the worst so far. Like, I don't know, man. I think Ash would be the second worst. But Rain is so way up higher because of, you know, what happened between Rain and Osborne. And, man, those Jaegers sucks, man. Why? But I've even felt immense guilt that we hadn't checked to see if we, if he was alive. That we hadn't taken him with us. There was another feeling, too. Oh my god. Man, at least Joshua remembers. Overwhelming joy. I can't say how happy it made me when I found out he had survived. Yep, which is Ash. Joshua. Man, Joshua is such a... You know... Thanks for being patient and listening to this long story of mine. Yep, his story. <laughs> Ash. Heh. <laughs> Don't know why you b bother telling me when it's not nothing to do with me. But it wasn't entirely boring. I managed to stay awake till the end. Damn. Damn, look at him, Ash. Being a tough guy. Man. But, dude, this is sad. Hold on a second. All right. Sorry about that. I'm back. Uh, let's continue. Man, I'm still sad. Huh. Glad to hear it. Thanks, Ash. Hamel tragedy took place at about the same time I was huh, first taken to... Oh, yeah, when Osborne brings Rain to Ymir and, you know, oh my god. I'm glad Ash was able to hear Joshua's story. Yep, his side of the story of re really what happened. Damn. Oh. Okay, let's chat with them again. Hey. Oh, I didn't know it. <laughs> Come on. How'd you not notice me? I was like standing there the whole time. Hey, Reen. <laughs> Dude, he's dropped much. Uh, yeah, I heard all everything. Sorry about that. But the same event Joshua was talking about pretty much changed the course of my life too. So it's at least a little relevant to me. Why so defensive, Ash? I thought you said Joshua's story had nothing to do with you. <laughs> Man, come on, Ash. Yeah, she's got you there. <laughs> Whatever, screw all, all that old drama. Wow. We got plenty of new drama we could talk about instead. For example, what's going on with you and Russell, huh? Uh-oh. The hell are you talking about? <laughs> Damn. Huh? Oh, why don't you share with the rest of the class? Ren, it's not like that. Damn, you can't even see what's right in front of your face, old man. Damn, we had to change the topic there. Dang, Ash. We all know what's going on. It's obvious to anyone with half a brain. Damn, who you calling old, you little brat? I'm only 28. <laughs> Why are we even talking about this? That's a very ash way to change the topic. Yup, exactly. He used to be such a cry... <laughs> cry baby. I'm glad Adios um, kept him safe. No, not just her. It's thanks to a number of kind of hearted people. Oh yeah. Thanks for sharing that story with us, Joshua. Of course, 
Thank you as well, Reen, for all you've done for him. Yep. Man. Holy cow. Cut the crap, man. Why the hell would you even say something like <laughs> Oh, jeez. What? I'm just curious. Seriously, though. If you don't make a move, some other guy will sweep Tita off her feet before you know it. Walk away. So, dude. Agate can, like, beat the crap out of you, uh, Ash. I mean, Ash is more of a trash talker. <laughs> what the hell? I mean, heck, I got my ass whooped against Ash on the... Uh, what do you call it? That pom-pom party. Damn. Uh, it's been more lively than usual around here, but... I'm glad to see Ash enjoying himself again. Yeah, seems like Agate's getting short end of the stick, though. I mean, dude, he's an a rank bracer, Agate. I I can't wait to I don't know I don't want to spoil myself to look it up online but no I was wondering like who's the S rank bracers I forgot I know there's an S rank after an A damn finally getting to tell Ash about all this it's really taking the load off my shoulders thanks for giving me the chance friend no problem you two are a lot alike You're both a little clumsy when it comes to your feelings. I can't deny that. Oh, this game's great. Holy cow. Alright, last group. I got like around 11 minutes. Let's uh, do this quickly. Now let's talk with Estelle, which is the main protagonist of Trails of the Sky. Um, I never dreamed... Huh. Yeah, President of Calvert and the Grand Prince of Rimaferia. Crown Princess Claudia and Lieutenant... Oh, General Cassius. And are here too, yep. Cassius Bright. Man, this place is crammed up top to bottom with big wigs. On the other hand, I'm just some <laughs> schmuck with an airship. What am I doing here? Mingling with them. Yeah, true, because uh, if I remember, she she told about her past. Like, she was used to be like an airship pirate, or what do you call it? Like an air pirate? Yeah, something like that. But she changed into a, like a delivery you know uh, what's the problem you're great at mingling and besides you've been helping out Lloyd and Reen a bunch no reason for you to not be here yeah true by the way thanks for helping me and Agate cross the border to the into the um, Empire Wow yeah Josette is also very important for transportation you know uh, things would have been way harder without you oh yeah Tch, you know I told you that was no big deal he saved my, my bacon, too, in the Heimdall. Wow. Seems like Capua... Deliver yeah, Capua Delivery Service is always there to help when we're in a pinch. Your services are a lifeline for, all, for the guild, too. Everyone's very thankful to have you guys around. <laughs> you don't work for Jaegers, uh, you s and you stay away from shady business. That's uh, that counts in your favor too. Look, it's a business, and we do what we have to do in order to turn a profit. <laughs> He's blushing. Oh, <laughs> you guys, stop it! <laughs> wow, they're making fun of her. You're really like teasing her, huh? Don't worry, it's friendly. Te it's friendly teasing. It's embarrassing. Leaves as well. Uh, as the branch campus used to be within the capital oh yeah baroni the members of the capital delivery service used to yeah that's what it's called though why did i say pirates what the heck uh, sky bandits yes yeah, sky bandits uh but they seem like decent people well you know she changed it's nice if i would have played the child of the sky but uh, hey reen quite the social butterfly today huh Making sure I get to talk to everyone. Uh, sorry about the if you hear noise in the background. Uh, Cassius is next on my list. Oh yeah, I can't wait. I'm gonna go straight talk to him. Maybe if I want to ask him, like maybe uh, because uh, I mean he's a master swordsman, right? Uh, it'd be cool if he teach Reen to master it, maybe. But we'll see. Makes sense since yeah, you both studied with Master Kafai after all. Yeah, the eight bleed, uh, eight uh, blade. Leaves, you know, I can't believe I screwed that up, but if I'm being honest, 
I'm not really sure why he and Chloe agreed to come all the way here. I don't know what to think about this, Duchess. Oh, that Cayenne. Uh, oh, wait, Duchess. Oh, my bad, a different one. Uh, the whole meeting is giving me some bad vibes. Yeah, Buse, my bad. Not a bad person, I promise. Oh, she's not a bad uh, person. The other guy was in Trails of Cold Steel 2. I can only imagine she must have been planning this for a while. Yeah, probably, I don't know, maybe way back. Tries not to show it, but the situation in the Empire was probably bothering her a lot. You noticed too, didn't you, Instructor? Yeah, I did. Yeah, I noticed a gun in her purse. But what, what I've heard, uh, Yuna saw right through her when they met back up. Sure, you may also be a genius who can come up with plans to change the fate of the world, but that's beside the point. Uh -huh. There's no way an ordinary girl like you would be okay with a plan that would cost millions of people their lives, is there? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> wow. Her mask fell for a second then. She's only 16 too, even younger than Fee. I've heard this, and that about the Cayenne family. The Duke, before the last, was widely believed to be just and wise noble. When he died in an accident, his younger brother inherited the title, but all he cared about was his personal... Oh, wow. Yeah, this guy. I hate you. The worst character ever in Charles of Cold Steel 2. He's his foolish uncle. Yep. Even stirred up the Civil War. Yep. And their family was about to be stripped of their title and privilege. Damn. And yet, here we are with Muse, Muse, the mastermind, behind a plan to save the world. Yep. She's got more guts than anyone in this ship. I think I can emphasize with her more than uh, more after hearing that. Me too. Oh. Huh. Judging from what I've heard, it's no surprise that she understands. Huh. There's no telling how these talks will go until they're, they're hand over and done with. But regardless of what major events are set in motion, we must not forget about the individuals that will be swept up. Musa is one of those individuals, so we do me a favor and stay by her side. Don't you need me to tell you that though? Damn! Talking from the first protagonist. Holy cow, hee <laughs> hee. You are really amazing. Yep, Trails of the Sky. Man. And you just say what you think without beating around the bush, huh? See now why Tita compares you to the sun. You're bright and you dispel any shadows of doubt in others. Thanks for the advice. That was my intention all along. But I needed the kick to get around to it. Glad to help. Good luck. Thanks. Damn. Alright, one more chat. I got like around four minutes and I'm going to end the video. Still, there's nothing I've been dying to know. You and Joshua are together, right? But how far exactly have you guys gone? Huh. That's so out of the blue. I'm trying to wiggle it out now. I'm burning with curiosity too. Touch the question unless... <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Why are you all bugging me about it? Or I can't tell you. When Reen's right there. What if he hears? Yep, I'm listening. Looks like they're talking about something personal. I don't want to be the third wheel. I better go. Uh, no, I want to hear more. What's up, Estelle? Still no progress? Need some cheering up? Don't say that. It's just, hey, knock it off with the leading questions. Oh, come on. I'm I'm the protagonist on the game. I'm the one who wants it. All right, I'm just joking, you guys. I want to, you know, talk with everyone. Oh, Estelle gets all flustered. <laughs> Makes me want to jump right in and ask her for more details. Sarah, Fee, please show her some mercy. <laughs> Gotta love how Fee, like, looks at you like that. <laughs> Love it. Anything else, B? Never mind. They both say the same. Tita? 
I'll try to do what I can, but don't. <laughs> okay, Tita, you're blushing really hard. I got this. <laughs> Last one, Estelle. Oh, okay. All right, that should be... Oh, everyone right there. So probably if I go right here, something happens. So I'm going to save that for the next video. Sorry about that. A little bit early. You know, I keep it around 35 minutes. So this is Ray on Trails of Cold Steel 4. Next time, uh, yeah, definitely a third, a triple upload. Next time, we'll see what happens. I mean, can I go talk to Cassius Bright or see what's going on? We'll see. Or probably there's got to be more, uh, you know, chit-chat. You know, just like in the third game, during the dance, um, you know, the ball, you know, the party thing in Heimdall. Yeah. So, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully you guys enjoy this, and goodbye, Reen.